guys, it's coming along. It looks so pretty so far. He's really giving it some shape. Um, and he's gonna clean up the bottom and then he's gonna come over and do this side. But what an artist to me. I mean, to me, it takes such, uh, oh, what is the word I'm trying to find? I, I feel he's an artist, you know, to take something so massive and, and sculpt it. I, I, I see the beauty and the appreciation into it because I love my tree. This tree is what sold me on this house and I love her. I have a bond with this tree and look at her. She looks so beautiful. I just, I'm one with nature, you know. Um, when we had to trim her because of our neighbors, when we first moved in, they got really upset because uh, as you can see, she hangs over on his property line. And, and with the laws, he has every right just to chop this whole section off. And we had just moved in, I would say a month into moving in, and he had hired some guy without telling us. And he started trimming our tree and literally butched the whole side. And my husband was at work. I had just come home from work and I was in tears. I was so upset. But, um, you know, because I hated seeing my tree getting all butched like that. It was so sad. But, you know, I finally went over and talked to my neighbors. And now we're on a good middle ground. And they were sorry for jumping the gun, you know, um, without speaking to us first. So we're on a good relationship now. And my tree is beautiful and big. And it's a statement for me, my tree. And I want her to look the best. And she looks beautiful so far. I can only imagine what she's gonna look like when she's all done. So I hope you guys are enjoying this. I know it's not reborn related, but hey, I'm glad you like it. Or I hope you like it. <laughs> all right, talk to you later.